Okay, hello YouTube. Today I am going to be showing you how to get the new custom map for Daisy called Panthera for Daisy Arma 2. And first of all, what you're going to want to do is come to Daisy Commander. Uh, link will be in the description. Once you come here, you're just going to want to click download. It's, this is going to be a very simple tutorial. Once you click download, just click get Daisy Commander right there. And just click save file. I already got it though. So once you download it, just run it, and this will come up. You'll see a list of servers. Um, I mean, there's just you know a bunch of servers for Daisy, and it's listed through all this. But to install it, you just go to install slash update, and you'll see a list of this. First of all, what you're gonna do is want to install the latest, or maybe not even the latest. Like go to server stats, and it says that nine seven seven one is the most like what servers are running so that's what I'm gonna just choose is you know 9771 just click install it won't say reinstall but since I've already installed it you know I just can click reinstall ain't gonna wait for it to download and once it don't alright you're just gonna click yes and this is just gonna make the newest beta patch click yes Alright, now it's been installed to the newest beta patch, or the one that everybody's running. Okay, now you're going to want to install the newest latest of Daisy. So it's going to say install. And if you don't want the newest one, I mean, what, it's whatever your choice is. But you know, 79% of the servers are running the you know newest one. So you're just going to want to click install. And this will probably take uh, 10 minutes or more. It'll probably take like 8 minutes for me. But unusual, probably like 10 minutes. Since it's already downloading, it's going to just install. And I'll get back to you once it's done. Okay, it just got finished done installing. And now I have the newest Daisy 1.7.2.6. Now what you're going to want to do is find Daisy Panthera, which is about in the middle. This new update just came out called 1.4. I mean, most servers are running 1.1, but if you want the latest, so because in the next couple of days all the servers will be going to the latest, you're just gonna, you know, click 1.4, and then you're just gonna click install. But for me, it's gonna say reinstall since I already have most of them, or half of them. So you're just gonna want to install it. It's gonna check to see if you already have it, because it's checking the existing file, and um. While we're waiting for this, I just want to talk about, sorry for me not posting, you know, videos lately. My account got hacked about a month and a half ago. So that's the reason I haven't put a video up for about two months. But I got it back, so it's all good. And I got a new microphone, or not a microphone, I've already had the Blue Yeti. But I got a new headset. Alright, but the DayZ Panthera, I think it's like 90 megabytes, somewhere around there. So as fast as your computer can install or you know download It'll, now it's installing but yeah I got the new Dre Beat Studios and they're amazing especially for DayZ cause I can, I mean I can hear people from miles away and zombies and gunshots and all that and it's good for like Call of Duty that's the funnest okay now it's installing I'll get back to you when it's still installing Okay, I just got finished installing the latest 1.4. So once you're done, just click done. And if you don't know how to use Daisy Commander, then you just want to watch the rest of this tutorial. If you do know how to use it, then you can just stop now. But what you're going to want to do is just click any mod. And if you're trying to find a searching like mod like Panthera, which will be right there, you can source it by um, the time of day, third person tracers, nameplates, crosshairs, death messages, you can hide wrong Arma 2 versions and all that so you don't have all those bad servers coming up. I like to sort by players because most of the custom maps only have, you know, a couple of servers that have a bunch of people. So as you can see, um, this server, I mean, pretty good, 28 people. Oh crap, what did I do? Alright, server 28 people, no bandits, friendly on. I mean, you just double click it and it will open up Daisy, which I'm not going to open it up right now. Okay, I hope you enjoyed my tutorial. Please click the left annotation for my channel and the right annotation to see my gameplay of DayZ. And I've done it from a couple of custom maps. Well, I've only done one now, 
But I'm going to be, I've already filmed a couple of other ones that I'm going to be posting lately. So, see you later.